I don't know how I got involved in the book arts. It was kind of an accident. My sister gave me a book that was made by local artists, and uh, I've loved books all my life, and it never occurred to me to make my own. I'm trained as a mathematician. I taught for 25 years, and to me, making a book is like proving a theorem. So I have something I want to say, and so I've got this project that I need to prove. And so for instance, on this one, I made a book that features um, a poem and it uh, features the poem about my Aunt Selma who I love so much and who loved nature and so this is what um, I created for her and then uh, we travel and I wanted to put some of the uh, Eastern Europe uh, photos. Um, I printed this paper myself and I have images that I've created of some of my favorite sites in Poland, uh, Hungary, and the Czech Republic. And I chose red because of the overlying communist feel uh, of, the, of the East. It's called a star book. Most recently I've gotten into wooden books because I'm from Humboldt County with the redwoods and lots of beautiful trees. Um, and this book is uh, made out of cherry wood uh, with driftwood, leather, and this is just a book about um, the Chumash Indians in Santa Barbara and a beautiful cave um, that they painted and I wanted the book to feel the, the reader to feel like they were actually in in the cave and then um, I also do uh, fairly medieval structures I like old-fashioned things and books used to have uh, wooden covers and so I've gotten into uh, using drills this is my tool shop over here and um, so these classes have brought me to uh, developing an art background. I have my first art class I took when I was probably 58, I'm 68 now, and it's led me to make uh, some books uh, that involve woodblock printing. So I've taken some workshops on uh, woodblock printing and I have a new press in my garage and I use these to make my books. I also like using natural materials and so I use dyes to boil the pages and uh, use plants from our environment that's so dear to me and I will eventually make these into a book. On every side. <laughs>